welcome back to Let's Play Fallout, uh, Fallout New Vegas. Um, I'm Jet Byron, and this is part of the Bethesda Challenge. Uh, why are we woeing? Before the powder dingers came to town, Johnson Nash ran the local store and the Mojave Express station. Everyone keeps woeing, I don't know why. Hello, Howdy, partner. Welcome to the Vicky and Vance Casino and Museum. Uh, all right. I don't have time for this. I need to talk to Deputy Deputy Howdy. Beagle. Howdy. Deputy Beagle. That's right. Uh, Howdy. Everyone has their guns out. It makes me really nervous. Um. Okay. Everyone can see me still. I don't want to steal anything. I'm not that kind of guy. So we're just gonna go. Oh, by the way. So, uh, I've explained this a few different Howdy. times, but. Um, in case you're new to the series, or just watching Fallout by itself, um, the, what I'm doing is, uh, for this last- Whoa, 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 whoa! Huh, huh. weird um so what i'm gonna do at the end of this cool. uh what i'm gonna do at the end of this uh playthrough this particular episode is uh i'm going to go ahead and uh just give brief feedback first impressions on the light Howdy. and uh hopefully uh, that won't. Ooh, safe. Sorry, I'm. I'm. I love this. I love this game. I love Fallout 3. So you may already have an idea of how the first impression is gonna go because uh, this just brings me back. Um, I think I might just have to run for it, um, or just vats and hope I kill them. Uh, anyway, so after this, I'm gonna take some fucking. Okay. Well, there's one. You know what? There we go. There's two. I didn't want to do that, but you really left me no choice. I gotta find somebody to sell my stuff to, because I'm sure I'm carrying like 50 outfits on me right now. Okay, so I gotta talk to the guy. I'm all over the place today. I'm so sorry. Okay, uh, anyway, I wanna do first impressions at the end of this video, and by the time I end that thought, it will be the end of the video. Um, and that's what I'm doing for the rest of the games as well. So I got two more after this. Whoa. Oh shit. Uh, nope, get closer. Boom! Come on. Seriously? Jesus. Okay. Um, using a lot of ammo up, but that's okay. Uh, your stuff. Pistolero. Uh, activate terminal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well done. Robot Industries. I actually don't remember how this works. There's one correct. I got it. So the end is probably right. 
but there's an N in the last letter for almost all of them. Damn it. So that doesn't help me. Uh, let's see. Laundry's different, so let's see if there's... Okay, nothing. Shit. Oh, god damn it. Okay, so there has to be an N. It tells me a lot of things. So, D-E, that's not right. C-E, that's not right. Wait. Yeah, okay. So that's not right. L-E, that's not right. Gabbing, possibly. G-A-B-B-I-N-G, okay. G-A-B-B-I-I-N-G, okay, so that's not right. So it can't be I-N-G. Present. Oh, here we go. P R E S E N T. E N T E N T E N T E N T. Looks. Uh, that looks good. Got it. Ah. Oh. oh damn. Enter password now. Got it. Oh, I'm so good. I don't even know. Disengage lock. This is awesome. Come on. Nope. Ha, 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 okay. That's... That's probably way more than I need, but let's just do it. I like that it stopped. Okay, cool. Jeez. Scared the crap out of me. Um... Awesome. So... Yeah, so this is uh this is awesome. I'm I'm loving it. Um, definitely, I'm pretty sure I'm sold on the whole um, playing this to completion for the channel. Pretty sold. I need to get I need the lock pick. That's the next thing I gotta put up. Whoa. Boom! Crippled your head. Got him. Oh, that's a dynamite. Okay. Whoa. Yeah, what? <laughs> this guy. Sorry, I'm once again loving this game right now, and it is hard to not just be completely enthralled by- Okay! He's not dead yet. And shot him in the foot. Alright, so, um, I also got a new weapon, and it's really wearing me down. Um... Drop. Drop some of those. Incinerator. Uh, I can also probably drop some of this armor. Yeah, I don't need these. And it's huge. Drop, drop, drop. Drop. There's no damage reduction. Drop, drop, drop. Drop, drop, drop. Okay. Look at all the stuff I dropped. And I have an incinerator. Why? Why not? Let's use this baby. Actually, I don't have time. So this is the end of the episode. Uh, I'm going to take the next few minutes to kind of talk about my first impressions of this game so far. And hey, found Deputy Beagle. <laughs> All right, well, the next episode we'll, we'll deal with that. So, 
just actually I'm gonna pause it so I don't get killed but uh so yeah so I want to take a few minutes and just talk about how I'm feeling so far this game takes me back uh, I gotta be honest aside from a few a little differences obviously the beginning way different um, and that's probably the selling point right it's a new story it's a new area um, but if I saw myself running through the desert and uh, and you showed me footage back to back with me playing Fallout 3 years ago I wouldn't be able to tell you the difference uh, which is not necessarily a bad thing because as I said Fallout 3 is one of my top favorite games and uh, with Fallout 4 on the horizon I am I'm stoked to uh, to get back into the series um, recently started playing Fallout Tactics once again very very different even from its uh, its predecessor um, uh, Fallout 1 and 2 uh, just the, the whole managing managing a team of people versus just your one guy and you know anyway uh, so this game itself uh, it looks phenomenal especially when it's uh, 60 frames per second which I happen to fix it and it's doing pretty well now um, the game uh, feels smooth the the VAT system obviously helps me out because uh, sometimes I like to think about the shots I'm taking rather than that so that part of the strategy RPG type deal uh, VATS kind of really helps me with that I know I have some friends who are like VATS is stupid I'd rather just shoot them and that's that's cool but um, I like you know I'm going for the headshot and uh, shooting and letting the computer figure out if I actually hit them um, kind of feels like cheating actually because I know I wouldn't be able to get those headshots on my own in the midst of everything but anyway um, so the gameplay itself I love it um, very identical to Fallout 3 but that's okay because it's cool um, the story itself I'm I'm intrigued I, I love it so far uh, I in fact found myself uh, just I not able to talk because I'm so enraptured by the whole the, by the story being told and that that immersion is probably one of my favorite things about games like this uh, immersion is so important to me when it comes to a game that is telling a story and this game has that uh, and uh, anyway so that those are my thoughts on on it so far um, I, I would love to give a little more in depth but I'm actually nearly out of time just from a technical standpoint I have about 30 seconds left so uh, this is day three this is Saturday's day this is Saturday yes Saturday's game so I uh, hope you enjoyed uh, I hope you enjoy some more because I'm definitely playing more of this I I'm so excited uh, to get this done in preparation for Fallout 4 and uh, I hope you stick around for more Fallout and the rest of the uh, uh, Bethesda challenge so this is Jeff Byron signing off